going on YouTube? It's your boy the Retro Wiz Kid, the Shoeologist, and y'all rocking with your boy in the sneaker dungeon, y'all. Man, y'all, y'all have no idea, man. We we've been on a long road to get this sneaker dungeon back, man. If y'all y'all have no idea, we back, y'all. We back in full effect, as y'all see, rocking live from the sneaker dungeon. It's your boy the Retro Wiz Kid, the Shoeologist. And I'm glad to have my stuff back, y'all. If y'all new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell for your boy. Make sure you join the Retro with Wiz Kid and the Sneaker Dungeon family. We trying to get this video up to 25 likes, y'all. Go ahead, you know what I'm saying? Smack that thing, it's free. Let's get this video up to 25 likes, y'all. And drop a comment below, and let me know what y'all thought about these kicks. You feel me? Shout out to my bro, Keon, man. Y'all seen him in the video for the, um, Taxi 12 pickup where I picked up the Taxi 12s from Shoe Pals for $94.99. If y'all haven't seen that video, I'll probably put a pin up here somewhere up there. You know what I'm saying? So y'all can go back and check that video out if y'all new to the channel. But today, bro, it came through. Bless me to check out these kicks, man. Now, I entered this raffle last week to try to get these. Y'all already know what it is. We're going we're gonna to start off with what it says on the box. So the 10. So as y'all see, man, we got these in the, the uh, eight, which is his size, cause bro let, let me do this review on these. So it's the 10 Nike Zoom Flight Tula Pink Racer Pink, y'all. So uh, let's go ahead, let's get one of these shoes about the box, you know what I'm saying? Now I saw this shoe at Sneaker Con in Houston. I'm gonna be honest, that I can remember only one person had this shoe on. Um, Y'all know what I'm what I always do. I got I just gotta do it because we ain't did it in the sneaker dungeon in so long. So I gotta do it, y'all. Hey, I must say, these things <laughs> smell test approved by your boy the retro whiz kid. Now, y'all, I must say these do have a a different type of smell. Y'all know I normally just smell the J's, but I had to get these a whiff, y'all. I had to get these a whiff. So let's go ahead and get this shoe out the box, y'all. There's the left shoe. Huh. <laughs> Off rip, y'all. This thing is fuego, man. This this thing is fire to me. I think they fire, bro. Was like, nah, he not feeling them. Um, but let's go ahead and get the other shoe out the box. He did. All right, y'all. So getting into the shoe, nothing crazy. Both shoes are the same. The only difference is the zip tie that is on this shoe and the actual right here, the little stick, the little, I guess you would call it little tag that comes made in Vietnam by all of the off whites get these. And of course, you had a little tag right here with the normal off white. Now, to me, this is like a baby bluish like color. So. Get into the Zoom Fly, very dope in my opinion. I think the shoe is pretty hot. Um, had to give y'all a little smell test approved on it to let y'all know what I thought about the shoe. But this is a great breast cancer awareness month. Now I've removed the tissue paper in this one, so if you're if you're if you're like wearing some socks, you can change the color. You know, and your socks is see through. It has like that nice. Kind of like you know when you when a snake sheds skin. That's that's the best way I could describe it. it. Feels like that's what it feels like for real. Uh, and I'm not gonna lie, it's the first time I've ever like really held the Zoom Fly and like had an up and close with it and with my own interactions. Now I've already went into the box, y'all, and inside the box you did get these shoelaces that came with it, and they're black. Um, only one one pair of shoelaces that came with them in the box. The box, of course, you have that classic. We'll look at the box because y'all know I am box gang shawty. It is um, that classic off-white box, what they've been doing with the reverse inside of the box. So what the normal box would look like, the normal box would come like this. Now, this is an Epic React box right here. That, um, this is like the OG Epic React, one of the first colorways. Uh, y'all know if y'all are new to the channel, then y'all know. But nothing nothing special in here. You know, oh, I, never, I didn't even notice that. They put a little... A little, little something right there, but these came from Nike. My bro, my bro, one the draw, of course. There you go, that quality control stamp right there. Very dope shoe, in my opinion. Now, bro, said he probably gonna get these things off, he don't really like them like that. But of course, you know, he came through. Well, what better way to open up the dungeon with an off white, especially one that I wanted to get but I didn't hit on? So, getting to see this in hand, I believe. I only saw one person at SneakerCon that had these on. You have that orange tag right there. A little flap tag, whatever you want to call it. 
Tulip Pinks, very dope shoe. Like I said, breast cancer awareness shoe. In my opinion, this is one of those shoes that you would rock for breast cancer awareness month. So y'all let me know what y'all think about these. All right, y'all. So that is the review in a nutshell. Nothing crazy. Just giving y'all a nice rundown of these Tulip Pinks. Did you all cop these in the draw? Did y'all win them? I know that um, they did a they did an actual, you know, you could have tried, I could have tried to get these overseas the same day, but I passed them up. I mean, Nike, what's going on? They released the Tulip Pinks here and they came out with a black pair just like that. And I'll put a picture here, there, somewhere. I'm gonna put a picture up. But they released them overseas, but we only got the Tulip Pinks last week. So be on the lookout. I know they're dropping the Air Force Ones that are um, out of the 10 pack. So are we going to get those black pair? If the black pair did drop and I just missed that, y'all let me know because I I, I didn't see them anywhere. I, I don't know if they released or not in the States. I, I, I've only seen them being released overseas. So drop a comment below. Did y'all pick these up? You already know what time it is. We on the grind of 2,000 subscribers, y'all. That's right, man. We are on the grind of 2,000 subscribers, y'all. I am going to be punch, putting out these videos left and right for y'all, catching up on videos because y'all already know, man. I'm back in my environment, back in the sneaker dungeon. I know a lot of people, I might have lost some subs along the way over the last two, three months as I've been in the process of moving. But y'all, Y'all that stayed with me, I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. And we on that grind of 2K, man. I'm trying to hit 2K before January 1st, y'all. So if y'all new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, ring that notification bell for your boy, the Retro Wiz Kid, and join the Retro Gang, Gang, Gang in the Sneaker Dungeon. You feel me? Shout out to my boy, Ryan Pepper, bro. Been, you know, messing with your mans for a grip. And I really appreciate all the love and support, bro. You know what I'm saying? I do. And I appreciate all the love and support that I get from each and every one of y'all. And y'all know what time it is. Don't forget, follow your boy on Instagram. Now that y'all know I got the kicks, we finna be doing the sneaker rotation on Sundays, getting back to our normal business. Y'all know I drop sneaker rotations every week, but it's kind of hard to drop a sneaker rotation when you're wearing the same kicks and you're living out of a suitcase. So that's back in action. If y'all haven't yet, head over to Twitter, follow your boy on Twitter. And, uh... Y'all already know what time it is, man. We finna spin them pictures for y'all. And I'll catch y'all tomorrow in the next video. Get it!